There are two types of people. The people who think there's only one way to use Google and the people that are right. Look, no matter what camp you're in, if you are all in on SEO or you're all in on building brand and having high intent search, you're right. There are two ways the modern buyer uses Google to do business. There is discovery search, which is people who are using long tail keywords to genuinely ask questions, to gather information, and to generate some initial education. Then there are people who use Google as a tool of access. These high intent searchers are using Google as a shortcut to a known brand that they have affinity for and they have already awareness of. This is the sort of search where people would be I'm searching for Acme widgets, as opposed to what is the best widget for this task. The latter, that long tail search, that's a discovery search. That's what you want to optimize for when it comes to SEO. And this is why Google and any search engine query is a two-in-one channel. It's an early stage discovery algorithm, like the feed here on LinkedIn or in YouTube. And there's also a high intent shortcut like a universal Rolodex or a bookmark that you don't have to keep. All you have to do is remember the name of the brand. And that's where good demand gen marketing come into play. So Google is neither a discovery channel nor a high intent channel. It's both because people are searching for it in both ways, depending on what stage of the buyer's journey they're in. And so you should have your strategy for awareness and for demand generation. Consider how your buyers are using Google and meeting them where they're at. In fact, you should meet them in both stages because they'll be there at different times in their journey. That's my thought for today. Thank you guys so much. I'm Mike Phillips. This is Marketing Muscle. Always be growing.